kan ook, kan ook, kan ook. Nou, vast, 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 vast. Kom maar niet, kom maar niet, kom maar niet. Zonder ladder, die zonder ladder. Oh my god. Oh my god. No. Oh god. Can he climb? I'm not looking down. I am not looking down. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Can he climb? Oh! Oh, I think I got away. I think I got away. Okay. I think I'm safe. I hate this game so very, very much. I, uh... I wish you could mod this game. I'd mod myself a flamethrower and come back here and have some fun. Alright, so we've got three closed doors and one open door. Some planks. Maybe I'll need those later. All right. So, I'll keep the door open so I know which ones I've checked. Very deep stairway. Okay. So, very deep stairway. I know I'm supposed to be going down. I'm going to check this one first. It won't budge. Okay. Two levers, tinder boxes, and some oil. All right. 9th of August, 1839. I can't stop sweating and shaking. The warding ritual was not something of a sane mind. I did not even realize the dungeon was still in use. Alexander had his servants bring one of the prisoners, a murderer, he told me. Alexander made all the arrangements, but he said I had to perform the ritual in order to have the right effect. The shadow could be led astray by the blood of another. Killing the man would provide us precious time. Okay. What else could I do? Alexander said it had to be done. He is saving my life. I don't have the luxury of argument. Hmm. So I'm making excuses. All right. What do you think? It's not working. Something, something must be wrong with the machinery. Two levers on the top floor are not working. It is probably some problem with the machinery. Yeah. Alright. So. 
I've got to go down into the bowels of the earth, fix machinery, and then activate those levers so that they do whatever they're supposed to do. Okay. All right. And I think I'll leave that door open because that's where I'm going to run if something comes. So, oh God. Right. Anything, Alexander? Yes. Soon, I won't even be able to move, will I? Your life is safe. I don't doubt that. But will it be worth living? Will it be worth living? Oh God, what did they do to Agrippa? Oh, could it be any darker? The lab. It won't budge. I'm gonna need a crowbar or something. Right. Can you wedge these things shut, you know, like put things in front of them? Oh God. A crucified man. Right now, I'm sort of hoping he's dead. I hear machinery. So I've got three quarters. Do that? Do I really want to do that? Do I really want to pull the switch? You know what? I've got to know. Next to me. Who's the switch? My gratitude. My name is Agrippa. Who might you be? Daniel? Like the prophet thrown into the lion's okay. den? <laughs> Tell me, are you among the lions, Daniel? You want to stop Alexander? Oh my. So Babylon shall follow you, sir. 
<laughs> so wait a minute. You worry too much. Alexander is toothless without an all. He has one. That's that's not very promising at all. The sector is basically a penetrant, but I guess the why hope. It could be breached by another, but Alexander broke his, I mean my own, a long time ago. Really? Well, if you tell the truth, by all means, seek out the pieces of the broken hole and mend away. So he's reading my thoughts. Pieces of torture now. They practically leap madness, which is quite useful, I understand. There should be six of them. Look around the choir and the transept. You should be able to find them there. So this is Agrippa and Dad. I hate to bother you further, but if you're really going after Alexander, would you consider taking me with you? I know it sounds ridiculous. I mean, look at me. But if you find anything concerning a man named Johann Heim, would you please bring it to me? I believe he was working on a way to help him. A recipe for some sort of potion, a tonic to free me from this husk of mine. So, that's Agrippa, but he's life. What level? Oh, that level. So many of Alexander's things are breaking down. Look around. Maybe the other room. There are machine parts hidden all over this place. You'll find a way to fix it. He's reading my mind. Okay. This is really strange. So. An orb is needed to enter the inner sanctum. So I need to go into the torture rooms. And Agrippa, the dying man, seeks a note written by a man. So that is Agrippa. Oh, good grief. It cannot be opened. Ah, the lever's downstairs. A heavy door is blocking the path. Yeah, you know what? torch around here. So, this is my only way forward. The torture rooms, I guess. Okay. Whew. Well. Oh, there's also upstairs. Let's do the downstairs rooms first. Okay. I guess that's somewhere to hide. Another one. <sighs> oh. I think I'll check all the cells. These look like cells. Light on in that cell. Oh God! I know this. I've been here already. I know this taste. The taste of Damascus rose, obfuscating the truth in a dim haze. 
They may sweep the traces from my memory, but my body remembers. It's can't speak volumes, even though my mind remains silent. They will be back. Uh, they will be back. Okay. Was that me? Sounded sort of like me. Oh. Okay. One cell light off, one cell light on. Oh god. <sighs> Something happened in there, I guess. Okay, so that just leaves us. What? Okay, okay, it stopped. Okay, I guess this is where I have to go. Such filthy thought, Gabo. <laughs> Sorry, I was drinking. Okay. Oh god, I'm gonna have to leave. I don't think I can stay here. Please, 
cells are meant to hold prisoners who are under treatment. The people you send for will end up here. Remember that the confinement itself works as a preamble to the torture, and you should pace yourself. Don't take anyone before they are ready. God, this guy's a complete... Sounds from the torture chambers are Bastard, shuttled in through those pipes in the ceiling. Manage your victims well, and let one prisoner's pain instill terror in his cellmate. So, can I go back in? Will he have, will he have reset, as it were? Or do I have to find a new way? Something about the sound in these. So I, 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 I wonder, am I supposed to do something in here to make sound? And, oh, God knows. All right, let's go find out. Let's go find out if he's gone. I'm not going to crouch because if he's there, I'm just turning around and running. The fear had begun to drown him again. He reached once more for the empty bottle of laudan laudanum. In frustration, he smashed it against the bedpost. Okay. Okay. Whoa, whoa, the door. He smashed the door open. He did, he smashed the door open. Why is it closed again? Right. It won't budge. I didn't expect it to. Green torches. Okay. Just a little further. It's like Orpheus descending into the underworld. Are you hiding something? What do you mean? Never mind. Your intuition is remarkable. I'm not sure I'm following. It doesn't matter. It's just a myth after all. Orpheus. I don't know that myth. Alright. Alright, so we've got... Four directions, I guess. All right, let's pick one and go. Oh. Is she dead? <sighs> okay, let's close this. I like to close doors behind me. There's a note there and another door. All right. Okay. Let's read the note. All is lost. I must once again start over. Ever since I recovered the orb first found by Agrippa, I have depended on it for my research. The incident with Wilhelm made me most impetuous. Fearing a paucity of prisoners, I proceeded with the final ritual without proper foresight. The orb cracked and fell into six parts. I've tried everything, but have yet to mend the thing. Unless I can think of a way to piece it together, I will have to find another. There is still life in the pieces, even if the orb isn't restored. I might be able to salvage some of its power for some other purpose. Centuries have passed in vain, and I begin to wonder if I will ever be able to see my love again. How much longer can I sustain life? 
All right, so this guy's been sustaining his life to try and resurrect his lost love. And he smashed one orb, and that's why he contacted me. Not because he wanted to save me. There's a big surprise, I guess. Alright. Do you think that's a clue for something? Okay. So, some sort of ritual sacrifice room. And... Okay. Right. It's kind of a cool place though, isn't it? Have a check this way. Straight on seems to be... I don't know. Check side rooms first in this particular case. I hear machinery. Right, so we found the machinery room, I think. And a note. Let's read the note. 12th of August, 1839. Banishment ritual is taking longer than expected, and we have to do what is needed. I spend my time helping out the prisoners. Being around these degenerates makes me ill. None of them even tries to face their punishment with any kind of dignity. They taunt me with their lies of innocence and their cowardly pleas of mercy. What can make a man fall so far yeah. from the grace of How a civilized you know? existence? They are all wicked men, and I'm I remind sure. myself of it constantly. Still, I am thankful for God sending these monsters our way, as they will serve as the instruments of my salvation. Sounds to me I like... I try to study the oh. different tools in the torture chamber and learn how to use them effectively. Last time was messy, and the effect suffered from my inexperience. When the next warding is to be performed, I shall be ready. Okay. I seem to be a complete monster myself. Alright. Okay, that is loud. That is very loud. Don't punch. Okay, I have to go round. We're going straight on after all. is. Oh god, there's something. 
There is something glowing in this room. She deserved it, that little bitch. That was me. I am turning out to be a complete bastard. All right. Yeah.